Attention! This gameplay video of Rise of the Tomb Raider contains spoilers of a specific section of the game. If you don't wish to be spoiled, please close this video now. Thank you and enjoy! What's good, ladies and germs? This is Clinton Navigator Bowman of the Out of Haven Productions, and we are playing Rise of the Tomb Raider. Shouts out to Microsoft and Crystal Dynamics Square Enix for sending me this game to play and getting a chance to experience all of the greatness that is Rise of the Tomb Raider. The section we are going into is the Soviet installation base, which is an open space in the game after you play for a little bit uh you're gonna jump right in and one of the first things you have to do is play through an infiltration mission for the most part so all you're really doing is just if getting your infiltration on and just discovering all types of different stuff so a lot of this game rise of the tomb raider will necessarily be scavenging building your skills and getting to the point where you can get to the end of the game and demolish and wreck stuff um you know collecting different items that's any basis of tomb raider game whether it's the old tomb raider games or the newer reboot tomb raider games so i mean the presence the presence of mind just to get in there and know you gotta scavenge to be able to craft weapons and you have to be able to know how you want to play based on your play style which the great thing about the level up system is, is crafted to you can craft it to your play style so if you're a big brawler then yeah you can just jump in and wreck stuff if you're a hunter you like to play long range that's where you go and if you're a survivalist and you just want to just you know go through things without getting caught or just going completely ham and hard in the paint and just doing your thing then yeah that's the beauty of this game so that's a lot of what we're going down through the rabbit hole with rise of the tome raider all right so this playthrough is the first mission part of the soviet installation base like i stated and it's a pretty long period of time and period in this whole game so it's just a beating different parts finding different tombs and just going through and figuring it out and understanding where you're going because it's and because it's such an open area at first you're not really going to have everything that you need to really go and open up the area and like explore but that's fine because this is this is where you're scavenging and you're hunting and playing through the game really gets you really gets you to open up more so the game opens up the game opens up the further you play it and that's always a good thing look at that stuff kill look at that i just caught him by surprise uh right there look at that right there sexiness right there um that that was that was wonderful that that was wonderful all right so we're gonna go distract them with some objects so we're gonna throw some objects just to get them separated i'm gonna separate him and then i'm gonna go throw another bottle and, and redirect the other one so let's give it a little bit of time redirect the other one throw it over there get to this guy first while he's behind i'm gonna get to this guy first the guy on your left while the other guy's redirected kill him with the arrow with the bow give me a good stealth kill get my parts at this point i w at this point i would have had i i leveled up to the point where oh uh, look at that oh can't see me you can't see me call me john cena baby because you can't see me that's right that's right caught him by surprise gonna take some wood as i go <laughs> So I did play the previous Tomb Raider game, uh, Tomb Raider on Xbox One, the Definitive Edition. Um, I didn't play it on 360 because, you know, my 360 decided to red ring of death on me. So I, all I had was my PS3 at the time. And I was really just playing sports games on my PS3. I played more of these games because I feel more comfortable on the, on the Xbox controller playing these games. That's just me. Um, so we're going to just jump up here and try to infiltrate. 
All right, so we got to investigate the helicopter landing area right now. Got a couple of XP. There's a lot of them arriving. Absolutely. It's a lot, of, lot more of them arriving. Uh, I'm just going to take a look and just experiment and take a look. I had to step. I, I believe I did take a quick step away uh, to take care of something. I think my mom called me at this time when I was recording this. Yeah. My mom's on vacation right now. She She's chilling out, so. All right, so. I'm just going to get my scramble on, hide in the bushes. All right, the fun part about hiding in the bushes is that you can't be seen. It's it's legitimate like think of think of it like playing think of it like playing World of Warcraft. I'm not excuse me. Uh League of Legends. Hiding in the bushes really conceals you. All right. So, now I'm just going to throw throw distract scramble. Just wait until the opportunity presents itself. Oh, look, bottle. So I'm just going to sneak around. Oh, I might see me. Sneak around, get that bottle. Oh wait, no, 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 no. Oh, scramble into the bushes. I'll check it out. You're clear. Go on. Scramble into the bushes, cast his cat by surprise. Blah 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 blah. Oh, look at that, right there. Another dead man. Another dead man right there. Sorry, sorry, I had to kill y'all, but y'all getting on my nerves. Now I gotta scramble right back. Scramble like a cat right back. Just make sure they don't see me. Scramble. To the other bush. Scramble to the other bush. Wait for him to pass. If the other one turn around. Oh wait. Catch that cat by surprise. Got he! Got he! Ha ha! Oh man. So hype. Alright. So I'm going to scramble again. I'm going to keep scrambling. You think with the amount of noise I'm making, I would have got caught. But nope! Nope! It's too cold for this noise. I'm gonna catch you by surprise, like eat you alive. That's that's all good. It is all good. All right, so I'm gonna take that lantern, even though I don't know what I'm really gonna do with it. I'm gonna just take the lantern. I'm gonna end up dropping it anyway. How much you wanna bet I end up dropping it anyway? I just wanna make sure there's no one behind it. Cast this cat by surprise. Nine millimeter rounds. Ain't no nine millimeter rounds for you. No. Ain't getting that. Nah, not not today, family. Not today. Uh, I'm gonna skip that box. Cause I'm still creeping around. Yo, better have my money, baby. That's that's how it is. You got these stealth skills. Like, yo, where's my money at? Where's my money, son? Where's my cash? Where's my bread? <laughs> so I'm just as you can tell, I'm probably having a lot of fun playing this game. I was having a lot of fun playing this game when I played it. Alright, so, okay. I can't pick up any more arrows because that's full. But I can distract. So I'm going to separate those two. Separate those two. Oh, I have him turn around. And go cast his cat by surprise. Surprise, mother... <laughs> Yo, that's exactly what it is. Surprise, mother... <laughs> Oh wait, what, 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 yo, what was I doing? What was those? What are those? Semi-auto pistol part. Oh yeah. <laughs> Ooh, this is gonna be fun. As soon as I get that semi-auto pistol part, as I'm listening to uh, WWE 2K16 in the background, yes, I have my PS4 and my Xbox One on at the same time. That that's amazing. Uh, so. Uh, Pretty much. That being said, oh, okay. Oh, 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 oh. I thought I was. I thought I fell. All right. So I just gotta scramble up there and get up there. You know, walk the tightrope and slide that slide, slide, slip the slide. Do 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 do. It's roll along. Let's grow along. <laughs> All right, so we got that box. We got some more. We got some more uh, spare parts. Okay, so I gotta burn that. I thought I was gonna go up. And I thought I could go back up. I thought I was trapped, and I was like, "Nah, I'm not really trapped." I, I, it took me a little bit to figure out. I'm like, "Oh wait, yeah, that's right, that's right. I can fly. I can flame those." Be like, fly, oh, baby, burn, baby, burn, disco inferno, burn, baby, burn, burn this mother down. Whoa, whoa. 
All right, so so just get it, just just get that gun and then get going. So I gotta do get that gun and get going. This is a part that I could not skip necessarily. All right, so a lot of the time with this, a lot of the time with this, I was like, what I was doing, I was kind of experimenting and figuring out where it should go. But because I didn't have the pick, I didn't have the lock pick, and I felt like I missed something, but I wasn't paying attention. Um, I wasn't paying complete attention. I was just trying to not get caught. So I decided to go back while I was singing the Buddy Bears theme in my head. I was like, we are the Buddy Bears. We're always head along. We do a little, every day we do a little dance, do a little song. If you ever disagree, that means that you were wrong. Oh, we are the Buddy Bears. We always get along. I, I, was, I was just singing it in my head, and now it's stuck in my head again. Yeah, I was watching a lot of Garfield and Friends, too, around this time. So, all right, so I couldn't go back up, so I had to go back. And that's where I decided to go ham, go hard in the paint, and just be like, you know what? I'm going to bust through this. Oh, 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 I did pay attention. I did get that. I, I did. I did get that. That's right. I did get that. So no one knows that he's there. And this was the Iron Road Red Arrival. So this was some remnant scout stuff that I had to go through. I mean, you can obviously listen to it and such and just go through and just like figure it out. Um, just wanted to track, you know, between the remnants and between, between the remnants and Trinity. I guess it's a war that you're getting stuck in the middle of just because I just want to, I just want to, you know, uh, check out some tombs. That's that's all I really want to do. Just check out some tombs, man. So I got my Russian up, but I didn't get my Russian all the way up, which was kind of something that kind of bothered me. So all right, so I have to go through there, but there's nowhere else I can go through. So I'm just gonna bust a cap in his head. Bow! Bust a cap, yo! Bust a cap in your head. Bust a cap in your head. Boom! Headshot, baby. Bust a cap in your head. Take it back to the projects. <laughs> Alright, so they got a dude in prison, apparently. So I'm gonna try to go the other way, but I believe I'll need the pot lock pick and I'll need the lock pick. Absolutely. And then the lock pick I get later. And then I'll just go through this door with my pickaxe and just be like, ah, open the door. Open it now. All right, so I can switch to different weapons because I have different weapons now. Yay, different weapons. Woo, different weapons. That's the best. Da best. Da best. Uh, da best. Do I need more arrows? Yes, I do. No, I don't, actually. But I got that ammo, so that's good money. All right, so all I got to do is just go up. All right, so here we have a cutscene that I cannot show, so we're just gonna skip right to the action. Um, just gotta find a way into the old prison. Nobody touch him. So it, it's gonna get a little weird because, um, I know I can do this, but in all honesty, like it got a little. Oh, here we go, caught him again, again. Ah, behind. Oh my god. Oh my god. Shouts out to Miss Spirit Duty. Oh man. Uh, Oh my gods. Oh my goods. Damn it. Alright, so I gotta get the distraction. Oh, 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 ooh, 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 I messed up. Ooh, I messed up. I messed that one up. It's hoping they'll come over here. Alright, so I'm just gonna throw that. Distract him. So as I distract him, this is where I mess up, right? I catch him, they catch me. And this is where things start to go H A M hard in the paint, ham in the paint, hard as a mother thumper. Like, you know what I mean? Hard as a mother thumper. You know, I had a hard as a marshmallow fluffer. Let's go. Yeah, I like that. Hard as a marshmallow fluffer. I'll, I'll, I'll probably keep that. Oh no! Grenade! Do you want to die? Do you want to die? You want to die today? You dying today? You dying today? Oh wait, who's shooting me? No, who's shooting me? Oh my God! You gonna die? You gonna die today? Uh oh! 
Oh, oh, headshots. Yo, I'm so godlike. I'm so godlike. And let me take you out your misery because, you know, you're screaming for your eyes. You're doing too much. Uh, you're doing too much. I don't want to hear that. All right, cool. Let's get that. Yo, let's get that. I'm going to loot his body. Because I'm going to loot your body. I'm going to take your stuff. I'm going to loot your body. I'm going to take your stuff. I'm going to take your stuff. I'm going to take your stuff. I'm going to loot your body. Going to take your stuff. Oh, yeah. Definitely. All right. So I'm trying to open this. But, you know, obviously, obviously, I, I got told I got to break the sucker open. So I'm going back. <coughs> picking up that weapons cache. There's nothing here. All right, so time to destroy a fuel tank, baby. Time to destroy a fuel tank. Time to get time time to get high. Time to get far away and throw this over there and just blow that up. Fuck out! There you go. That's more like it. I, oh, oh, they heard, so I gotta make sure. They heard, so. Uh oh! So I gotta tap X, and I'm just not forgetting. Oh my god, I gotta tap X. Yo, I'm under heavy fire right now, man. I'm getting, I'm getting, I'm getting clapped on. Like Clinton Bowman is getting clapped on. As we approach the end of this segment, uh, yeah. He threw a grenade. I had to get away. Clapped him in the back. Clapped him in the back again. Got him with a headshot. Yes! Headshots all day, baby. <coughs> Excuse me. All right, ladies and gentlemen, as we approach the end of this segment, I'd like to thank you for watching the first segment of the whole of the whole uh, Soviet installation. We'll have a little bit more later in the week. For now, I'm Clinton Navigator Bowman of the Out of Haven Productions, and I'll see you guys later.